Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Prime, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. Today, I am going to be experimenting. So, um, whoa. So, uh, there is a little bug with the, the female wobble heads, where if you put them on a truck, they don't move at all, right? They're, they're like locked in place. Well, I had an idea. Does this happen on all the trucks, and will it happen if we put something up in the air, hold on, let's re-res this one. Okay, so if I take this and I like put it up in the air, like so, and then we grab one of these wobbly heads, come on. Oh, that's, that's gonna be a hard, eh. no, that didn't, didn't. Oh, come here, come on. Oh, I, I, I know, I know, I know what I can do. There we go. Boink. <clears throat> so, if we set this at the back, right, then we come over here and we do a, a one of these. Oh, nice. And we set this on it. Come on. Come on. Uh, 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 nope. Just get on the thing. Would you please just... There it goes. Okay. Once that's on there, it should be locked in place, right? So I can't, I can't go forward, can't go backwards, it's locked. What if I move this? And we set it down here. Oh, it moved. Okay, so that really is uh, stuck. Something's happening with that. So that is a, a, a nifty little glitch. I don't know if we can implement it somehow, but uh, keep, your, keep your brains thinking and we'll We'll come back to it. Next, these. These are tires, right? And they have joints on them, right? These little things on the back. Those are actually uh, like motors. Back whenever the motors, I don't even know. Do, do the motors still work the same? Kinda, sorta, not really. Um, so if this has a join on it, or a, a one of the surfaces like I think it does, it should be able to attach to a door. Maybe, possibly, I don't know. That's what we're going to experiment. That's what, that's the whole point. That's why we're experimenting. So let's see about, about what? Uh, two units up maybe, right? So if we go right about there, let me take this. And we set it right about here. No, nope. I would I would say a little bit higher up. What do you think? Whoa, whoa, whoa! I didn't I didn't want it to open that way. Whoa, 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 whoa! What are you doing? <clears throat> okay. So let's go a little bit higher. Maybe like one unit, one unit higher. Uh, can can we can you please stop moving around? Okay, there we go. I think that's the same spot, isn't it? Yeah, that's the same spot. So um. I would say about two, two uh, thin floors, right? Two thin tiles. One, two, and we can take and chop, chop this. Come, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. And boom. Oh, we need one more. Two, like that. All right. Let's check. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's that's perfect. Okay, so stand on this side, open the, oh wait, I need to see where it's at lined up wise. Okay. So that's going to be like right in the center, right? Slight, slightly off to this side. Okay, okay, I got this, I got this. So, we're gonna move this. Oh, oh, lift. Set you down right there. Slightly off centered. Move B. Did that did that even attempt? Ooh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. That's awfully close. Okay, so let's come come this way just a little bit more. Right about there. Just off center. 
or off the edge. Did it push it back? No, it's it's in there. It's just not attached. Move B. Did that attach? It did not. Okay. So nothing we can do there. They are uh, non-collide. So if you don't know what non-collide means, watch. Um, when I hit the side of the tire, right, it collides. There's there's collision there. But when I swipe it across the top of the, uh, whoa, the top, that yellow thing right there, it's no collide, right? <clears throat> so that could possibly be one of the issues, one of the problems, because it's no collide, it's not going to attach to anything. So, um, what else could we do with a tire? Let's see. Oh, if we had a bunch of tires all in a row being held in place by stationary conveyor belts, we could have something rolling across the top of it. So, all right, I'm going to break down my elevator here. Move. Uh, there we go. Move. There we go. Move. Good. And move. Good. I'm not going to have very many because I only have, uh, I think I've only got four tires. Do I have any more tires? It's just four tires. So, uh, if you purchased a lot more tires, you might be able to do this. But, let's see. How wide do I need this? Let's go turn. I'd say about that wide. Let's, uh, let's see if a, a tire will stay in there. Ooh, maybe not. Maybe uh, one more over. Let's go. Yeah, that, that's too thin. That's too thin. Yeah, that's that's not gonna fit. So let's come back over. Move. What if what if we do one to this side and then one to the other side? Are they are they that? Ooh. -hoo. Uh, it might be too wide. Oh, no, it's not. Yay. So, that looks uh, kind of good. Kind of good. So, let's, uh, that's not a brick. Okay, close this. We're going to go here. Move this. We're going to stick it right here at the end. So it can't come off the end. Oh, we should probably fix that at the other end. <laughs> All right, move. And we'll just place these end to end. End to end to end to end. Like that. Whoa. Oh, dude. It could be a conveyor belt with no edges. You'd have to have big pieces of wood for it, though. Yeah, that'll work. Okay. Uh, and, oh, I can also use these. We'll, we'll use these for the end as well. One here. One here. Whoops, was that off center? Nope, we're good. And put one right here at the end. This will prevent the tire from running off the end. There we go. There's one. There's two. Oh, it might work. There's three. And... and oh, oh, come here. Oh, there we go. Turn, 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 turn. Bunny Films, if you're watching this, uh, definitely take note, because I think you purchased a lot more of these presents than I did. Is that lined up yeah it's lined up okay this is this is kind of kind of dark over here let's uh let's spread some light right uh we'll do this go forward go back go forward yay experiments 
There we go. Light. Oh, it does not like me standing on it. Okay, okay, okay. I feel you. I feel you. What about this? Oh, I still have a, a tire over here. Yay. Hold on. I'll go ahead and open that up. We'll use it. Whoa. Phantom present. Uh, do I have room for one more? I don't think it's going to fit. I don't think it's going to fit. Oh, no, 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 no. They're starting to pop out. Okay. Um, hmm. Maybe if I move this one slightly down and out. Like that. Does that give this enough room? Yeah, there we go. Oh, that's cool. Okay. <sighs> so let's grab uh, grab this big flat board. All the tires are moving in the same direction. Drop. Oh, that did not did not compute. Hold on. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! We got. It got stuck on a wire. Oh, failure, fail. Big fail. Okay, hold on, let's try again. Maybe maybe if we were to build up some walls, some lulls. Come on, there we go. And let's get this out of the way. Move, you come down here. Move. You come down here too. And can we can we go ahead and just uh oh come on. Can I can I move this? There we go. Short wall. Oh I'm not gonna be able to put it on there because the, the non collides are in the way. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, that's kinda cool. not very fast though. You know, it's just barely on there. Okay. Drop. Drop it like it's hot. Hee <laughs> It's a conveyor belt, but it's not. <laughs> oh no, it's popping the tires out at the end. No! Stay in there, tires! Okay. So we definitely need a, a higher wall here at the end. And since I had that failed experiment from the very beginning, I can go ahead and Go grab that piece. Let's go grab this one. There we go. Mev. Come here. Come here. There we go. And can we drop this? Oh, this is the... Oh, that's the wrong piece. I need... Not this one, but this one. There we go. Okay. So... If I place this right here for now. And then I should be able to move this down here and then I should be able to move the oh no whoa 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 uh okay that's kind of cool I'm just I'm just gonna here get them out get them out of there move and come on just would you attach to the end please Dear Lord, why is it taking so long? There we go. Actually, wait, I can't have it that high, can I? Ooh, that might be a problem. That could be a problem. Whoops. Uh, okay, that works. I love playing with uh, the items to try and figure things out. Now, some of my experiments aren't very practical. Like, there's no application that this could be used for. But, I mean, it looks cool. I think it's cool. So now what happens when we drop it down? Oh, it's lifting. What in the world? What? Why? Why did it? <laughs> I don't understand. Okay, and when I stand on it, it does it kind of does the same thing, right? 
Well, you could make it look like a tank rolling through the desert. Oh, bunny. Go make your, uh, your tank, only with moving wheels. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. Okay, okay, let's stop playing with the tires for a moment and look at the hatchet. Now, this is an actual book. Um, I think uh, required w reading for wilderness survival as written by one of the industry's leading experts. So it's an, it's an actual book. Uh, I forget who the author is, but just a candy cane. Uh, they're always just a candy cane. What's, is there, is there an activation button on this? Hold on. I guess it would activate if we pressed E on it, wouldn't it? Okay. Nothing there. I wonder if we, oh, can we burn it? Can we take it in the volcano? I don't know. I don't know that that's going to actually work or anything. It's just a candy cane, okay? <sighs> One thing I've learned is don't take Defaultio just at his word. <laughs> when he says it's just a candy cane, it might not be just a candy cane. Just saying. Uh, the ball we know doesn't do anything. It's it's uh, it's tra tradition. The number. A lot of people are saying it's a combination. It's a secret code. It's something. No, it's the count. Okay. So when I opened this one, there was forty-seven thousand. Uh, no, four hundred and seventy-eight thousand six hundred and sixty-six of those particular balls that were opened. Same thing with this one. As soon as I open it, it's going to calculate the next number: seventy-two thousand four hundred and seventy-seven. So when I open another one, 73,478, 73, and the next one, hopefully, see somebody else has got 43479. Somebody just now, somewhere in the other servers, opened a ball and that was its number. Once that number has been created, it will never be created again. So every single one of these balls has its own individual unique ID. So um, a lot of people are like, code, what happens if you duplicate the ball? What, what happens if people start duping these? If people start duping the ball itself, the ball, like the duplicated ball, will create a new number. Like you'll, you still won't get the same number of ball. It's just, it doesn't work. So um, these were the hatchet, right? Yeah. So I got a bunch of these. I was thinking about making a library. Does it work if you put it into the thing? No, probably not. Okay. So, um, one of the experiments that you guys told me to do is take the book over to Hoover and see if, uh, see if Hoover says anything about the book. I doubt he will, but we'll see if he's even there. If he's not there, I'm not, I'm not going to do it. No, he's there. Okay, Hoover. We're coming to see you. Oh man, taking forever. How far? We're 18 minutes into the video. Oh my gosh. Okay, there we go. Oh wait, I guess I gotta get the book first, don't I? Whoa, whoa. Grab the book. All right, Hoover. Did you author this? Did you, did you pin this? Hold on. Let's see if I can, if I can set it down right there. Hi, I run this ferry. Uh, I'll buy a ticket. No, well, you're a super hoover, so you don't need a ticket. Hi, I run this ferry. Well, when do you run next? 27 seconds. Oh gosh. Uh, okay. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Get off the boat. Get off the boat. Run! Woo! That was close. So, it doesn't look like Hoover does anything, but, I mean, I could be wrong. Because somebody was telling me to put the eyeball inside the, the toll booth a long time ago, and I didn't figure out that you actually had to take it and balance on the inside of the thing. And that's a hard task to do. I'm just saying. Uh, some other experiments that we could possibly do is take the candy cane up to the ice area and see if there's anything in there. Uh, somebody else said try it inside the lighthouse. Um, if you're if you're a fan of me and you've seen most of my videos, 
you'll know that the lighthouse is actually a model from another thing that Defaultio did, another game, where he took an image of a pier and recreated it inside Roblox. And it was a live stream. So somebody was saying, put a tree in there, put a tree, where's the tree? And he put a potted plant. It's like, <laughs> <clears throat> He, like me, trolls his fans. Sometimes. <laughs> but he's very secretive. Lots of secrets. Whoa, what was, what was that? Oh no, it's just the edge of the mountain. Okay. Oh no. Come here, candy cane. Green candy cane. Okay. So, we'll drive this in here. Then I'm gonna jump out and I'm gonna run. <sighs> we got to keep an eye on it, make sure that the boulders don't smash it all up. Don't smash. No smash. But you can smash that like button and comment and subscribe and notification bell on. If you want. I think that was it. That's, that's it. Okay. So, should I head back down... Hmm. I feel like I should stay, but I don't know why. Oh, that, that's horrible. Does not work for birch. Does not work for oak. Man. I wonder if you dropped him into the Shrine of Sight. Would it give you anything? Or if you took one of the candy canes and from last year and one of the candy canes from this year, maybe. Take you over to Candy Cane Land. Candy Cane Land code, what's that? Nothing. That is a rough cut. Three hits versus what, six? Yeah. Okay. Let's go see if it's done anything. I doubt it has, but I'm bored. I don't want to wait. Has the book changed at all? Oh, I was like, oh no, the writing's gone. <laughs> no, it's just the, the back side of the book, that's all. Okay. The hatchet, uh, I think it's, um, isn't it where he's going to his father's or something and the plane crashes and then he's got, uh, the only thing he's got is the clothes on his back and the hatchet that his mom gave him or something like that. And it, like a survival guide, maybe. I think that's the, uh, the premise of the book. Of the actual book, not the not the Hoover book. The Hoover book is a recreation of the hatchet. By the way, if you read the book, it would probably give you some insight into uh, Defaultio's taste, I would think. And demeanor. Give you a little bit more of an understanding of them, I guess. But, um, somebody who's uh, introvert and eccentric might, might put a book in here just to troll us. It could, who knows? It could be like the worst book ever. I have no clue. I just remember, uh, remember either a synopsis of it or somebody had done a, a book report over it. I, I can't remember. Is that... Okay, hold on. I need to get a closer look at the title of this thing. Here. I could have sworn I just saw... Boxes. Hold on, am I seeing this correctly? Hold up, 
hold up, hold up. Let me zoom in a little, little bit right here. And let's see if I can get this to zoom. All right, Roblox game. Let's go ahead and duplicate this one. Can I duplicate? Duplicate, duplicate, duplicate. I can't duplicate the source. So, it is this area right here because this is the ladder. Why would the hatchet show this? Captain Hoover, hatchet by Captain Hoover. There is a skeleton inside the um, the power where you get the power to build. And this right here in the background of this book, that is the ladder that you climb up at the bottom of the, uh, the ravine to, to get down into the thing. That's at the bottom. A a am I wrong? Am I, am I completely off here? I could be completely wrong, but that looks like the thing at the bottom of the the thing all right hold on transform let's go ahead and reset the transform transform stretch to screen fade that back out um hang tight one second okay 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 i may have found the actual image that was used in the background of that book but now it's dark time <clears throat> and i can't see it Okay, hold on. Let's stretch this out again. There we go. Just like that. Okay. So first things first is I need to uh, I need to shed some light on the situation. Where's my floodlight? Come here, floodlight. Come here, you. There we go. Good thing I don't cast shadows. So, let's do this. I'm going to fade this in. Then I should be able to pull in the uh, wiki page. Right. Where are you? Okay. So this is an image from the wiki page. Okay, do you guys see this right here? Um, hold on, you can't see my, there we go. See this area right here? I believe that that is actually the background, whoa, to the book right there. Somebody tell me I'm wrong, or at least like it's it's on the Wikia page. I definitely feel like this is on the Wikia page. That right there is the image that I found, and I believe that's the background to the hatchet. I love discovering secrets. Secret found. Yes. Well, association found. <laughs> So, um, that's that we're, we're at 30 minutes. Let me, whoa, we're all zoomed in and stuff. Oh my gosh. What happened to me? Transform, reset, transform. Oh, not that one. Not that one. I need the Roblox game. There we go. Transform, reset, transform and transform. We're going to stretch the screen. Fade, 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 fade. There we go. Woo. What secrets lie within the Lumber Tycoon 2 game? I shall find them all.
Gotta catch them all. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, oh. Oh. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Send me tweets of all your bases. I would love to see them. I'll, I'll like them and, and comment and do all kinds of cool things at Code Primate on Twitter. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. Oh, wait, did I say subscribe? Yeah, you need to subscribe and turn on the notification bell. As always, I love you guys. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon. Outro. Want some new merch? Check out teespring.com. Outro.